Welcome to Tor Beta Math. In this video I'm going to look at long division. I'm going to start in this video with the easiest one where there are no decimals and no remainder. Consider these two numbers 5624 divided by 37. I put them in the bus stop grid. 5624 goes inside the bus stop 37 goes outside. The key is that you need to know, in this case, your 37 times table. Now few people can record their 37 times table straight off the top of their head, so the easiest thing is to show it as working. So down the side here, I've written down the 37 times table. And the way I've done that is that I know that 137 is 37. To get 2 times 37, I double the 37, 3 times, I add another 37 onto the 74, to get 4 times, I add another 37 onto the 111, and so on, all the way down. Now I don't need to do all the values down to 9, because I might not need them, so I could just start with a few, and add more, should I need them. So I'm going to look at, using this times table grid, to do this long division sum. So first of all I'm looking at 37, does it go into 5? Clearly not. So I'm moving on and doing 37 into 56. I can see that that goes once, because 1 times 37 is 37, but not twice, because 2 37 is 74. So I'm going to put 1 there as my result and 37, which is 1 times 37 there, and I'm going to work out a remainder by taking 37 away from 56. Answer to that is 19. What I know now is I pull this 2 down to here, and I have 192, and I'm going to do 37 into 192, and put the answer there. So if I look down my times table, I can keep going down 185 and then 222. So clearly it's 5 times 37 is 185 because 6 times is bigger than the number I've got, 192. So I'm going to look at 5 and I'm going to put 5 times 37, 185 in there, and I'm going to work out another remainder. Obviously, the remainder is 7, 192 take away 185, and I bring down that 4 to give 74. Then look at this, and I'm going to put the result there, which I've already done, as you can see. 37 into 74 goes twice, you can see from up here, and in this case, when I've taken 74 away, I have no remainder. So that's the basic principle of it. Whatever you're doing with decimals or whether there's remainders, the principle would remain the same. There would just be a little more to do at the end, which we'll probably look at in another video. And there's our result at the bottom. 5,624 divided by 37 equals 152. Thank you for watching.